Hello, this is lab number five. I'm with my friends. It's a girl's night, but I'm gonna make the butter. So here we go. Here we go. We're gonna pour a hat or fill it. Let's fill it. I don't think I'm gonna fill it up. That's This is a pretty big jar. Yeah, you don't. I think that's good. Think that's like half of this. Mm -hmm. Okay. now been like 15 ish minutes and it's now solid with buttermilk oh, so i have to taste this oh dear gosh yeah, okay oh. i don't want to <laughs> um okay i really just do i really have to is that all the paper sauce yes but yeah <laughs> ew oh my god that's rancid ew. Okay. It tastes like butter and milk. Well. It's not bad. It's not bad. Okay. So now we're going to separate it. What? All the milk out of the jar. So now the jar is empty. Okay. Okay. We added the water to the jar. Is it sealed? Yeah. Okay. Now just start shaking. We're going to shake it until it gets uh, clear. Great. Um, the water. Oh. Oh, she's not using that. I'm not using that. She's not using that. Okay. So, we got the clear water to dump out. So, now we're going to add some salt. I don't know how much salt. You think that much? Yeah, sure. Okay. We're going to add this much salt. A lot of salt. Okay. I'm not going to. It's okay. We make in salted butter. Um, so, there's that. Get out of the jar. So, I didn't take it out of the jar, but I added the salt. So, let's just, you know. Get some salted butter, I guess. I thought like I needed like a cup poured in. A cup poured? A cup. Oh. All oh. right, here it is. Oh, it's water. Okay. Oh, wait. That's pretty good. Oh. <laughs> here's my. Oh, here's my butter. Should I taste it? Yeah. Okay, that's pretty good. It's gonna be really salty though. Whoo! <laughs> salty butter. But that, <laughs> that is my lab number five, and I made my butter. And now I will include my time segment of when the periods changed. Okay. The only bread that we have is pizza crust. So technically it's toast, right? Yeah. Okay. But here's my butter. So I'm just gonna. You know, dip it in. All right. Type for <laughs> It's not that bad at all, actually. explain how spaghetti is chemically and physically changed so obviously for spaghetti with meat sauce you're gonna have to cook the noodles so that's gonna be a chemical change because once you boil the noodles from a solid to like the actual pasta you cannot go back to the solid form of the pasta so that is going to be a chemical change because the heat has cooked the molecules within the solid pasta and has now made it um i really don't know how to describe the texture of it but just soft pasta and then for the meat sauce you need to cook the meat because raw meat is really bad for you um so that is also going to be a chemical change once you chemically cook the meat on the stove you cannot uncook meat back to raw meat um you will also be cooking the sauce that's going to be a physical change technically when you are making the sauce 
you could separate the meat from the red sauce that is in there and once the dish is actually put together you can separate the sauce from the noodles but that is how spaghetti is made chemically and physically changed but this is lab number five so thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it was kind of a rambunctious video but that is it so thank you so much